Right oh you not. Let's get this out of here. <coughs> I've got this in here today because it's still broken, the knuckle's still broken, the drive shaft probably gonna fall out. But I wanna see what this engine is like with this exhaust on it. Um, I reckon it's gonna be really good. I reckon it's gonna perform a lot better than it did before. And I reckon we're gonna go well. So let's um, get the uh, the GoPro that it doesn't work on me head and uh, get going, shall we? Here we go. It's cold out here today for some reason. I can see my breath. I don't know why that is. Oh. shaft is stuck under there look. Oh, what a bastard. Such a bastard. Such an absolute bastard man. See my trouble is my GoPro the battery's gonna the battery's at it. So that won't last ten minutes. It won't even last that, it won't last two minutes. I think. So I've got to hurry up. And uh, now, the drive shaft's come out, causing me a bit of trouble here. It's got jammed under that bastard. Oh, I'm trying to unjam that. How the bloody hell is that? Got jammed under there. Oh. Come on, you bastard. Right, let's get out. Let's get out this. What's that one? Is that the right one for that? Yes, right. Take this pesky droop screw, as they call it out. We don't need no droop screws. Right. That's it. There we go. Right. Let's take this. I can't even take that drive shaft out because um, it's got a stupid CV joint on it. Right, let's put this screw back in here then. It's because the knuckle's broken. That's the reason why that is. So, right. Now we should better get going again. Just screw back in, didn't I? Let's put this screw back in. I've only got limited time this morning. I can't be fanning around fucking dickheads like this today. So let's uh oh fuck. Let's uh come on. You know what happened to me? You know what happened the other day, right? Some, uh, we had some family members come round, <laughs> right? <laughs> and they brought their dog, right? <laughs> and my neighbour, it's a shared drive, and my neighbour come <laughs> and he told them to get the dog off the driveway. They couldn't believe it. They was in shock. <laughs> They were like, he's so rude. <laughs> I was like, I know. <laughs> oh dear. Funny old life, isn't it, we live really. People like that around. Right, let's uh. 
It definitely goes full throttle. Definitely goes full throttle, that's good. Don't like ticking over at the moment though, I have to sort that out. Can't not have a tick over. Got to have a tick over. <coughs> oh dear. Right. Of course she's hot now. Look at that smoke coming out of that engine. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, let's sort this tick over out. Bloody thing. It's all because I've got to retune because there's a new exhaust on it, that's why. Don't panic. <laughs> oh, still a bit low. Sound a bit rough. Doesn't sound very good, does it? power all of a sudden. Not in the water. The trouble is here, I reckon, and Jack. Yeah. Yeah, the little O-ring's gone on that, on that jet, on that ring.
Yeah. Needs a new seal on that on that high speed needle. Because the needle's coming out by itself and making it rich. than you can imagine at the moment. <laughs> oh, we're back home now. Um, I don't know how, how much footage that GoPro got because the battery ran out. I, thought, I, I was running for about 20 minutes. I had a full tank and it was um, it ran out and that's about 20 minutes worth. A full tank on this is about 20 minutes. Um, but yeah, that was running really well. With that exhaust, it was running brilliantly. We have got a bit of a problem now with the high speed needle. The O-ring has gone, probably gone a bit brittle on it, and it make it richens itself up. So you, <laughs> so as you saw there, I'd tune it down and go a bit. It'd be nice, and then it would go richer and richer and richer, and I'd tune it go richer and richer and richer. Um, but the GoPro battery run out. The go that that old go, that's a very old GoPro, and the battery on it is it's a Duracell battery actually. It's a new battery. It's about a year old that battery, but it don't last. It's had it. Um, but anyway, hope you enjoyed that. I was got carried away chatting to my mate Barney um, so I didn't get to say ciao for now earlier on so uh, it's the end of the day now obviously but yeah I hope that was alright you enjoyed that kind of thing um, well, I'm really as I say I'm really I've still got the broken knuckle there I need to fix that um, but they're expensive you know, they're about 17 99 for one no it's not it's for two but that's for the ready to run ones I want to get the stronger ones I want to get the kit ones and then you're looking at 30 odd quid for both and it's ridiculous so I will get a new knuckle at some point but for now it seems to drive all right it's just a bit funny on the steering but um, the rest of it's completely fine so sweet as I say that goes man that manifold in that bigger pipe really does help this engine to breathe better you can feel and hear it breathing a lot better so top but top marks for that proper happy with that I'll catch you a lot on the next one don't forget if you want stickers just uh, let me know, find me on Instagram, or uh, send some money to the PayPal. The stickers are a pound each. I've also got them ones as well, look, also a pound each. And the repair on the Savage, you'll see it shortly. All the best, you lot. Cheerio.